Hey there, boys and girls, welcome back. This is The Gerbil, and in today's video, we're going to do a quick little review and breakdown of the Gear Completion Bundle 1 that pops up in the store from time to time. Now, this bundle is only $5, and so we're gonna compare it to the $5 bag of crystals to just kind of give it a realistic price point in terms of value of crystals per dollar. Now, the bag of crystals is easy. 610 divided by five is 122 crystals per dollar. But what about about the gear completion bundle one now this can be a bit confusion because CG does not make this easy to understand I mean I've seen memes over on reddit where people to say I'm never gonna buy this because I can't understand what the hell you're saying over here on the side where you have to scroll up and down with a teeny teeny tiny tech uh, text <laughs> so I'm gonna try to break this out and make this a whole lot easier to understand okay so on the left when you look at that you think five dollars you get all that stuff wrong 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 I think a lot of people have made that mistake of buying it without reading it thoroughly expecting to get everything and you only get two pieces of something and you're just well you're pissed off so let's check this out for five dollars this gear kit actually breaks down into four potential outcomes and they will always be one of these four you will always get this yellow kit which is going to include 50 shock prod salvage pieces with 25 battle computer salvage or the red kit which is 50 stun guns and 25 stun cuff or the blue kit, which is 50 Carbonti salvages plus 25 biotech implant components. There is a 4% and only a 4% chance of getting 50 of each of the computers, the stun cuffs, and the biotechs. The other three up top, you basically have a one in three shot at, 32% chance of. Now I've bought this kit, I don't know, eight, nine, 10 times or more, and I'm gonna tell you that I've hit that blue kit, I would say, easily 50% of the time. So what are they worth? The blue kit on the right, the Carbontes and the biotech implants. That is the least desirable outcome actually because the Carbontes, uh, you, you can get them much easier and much quicker. Of course, you know, in the Tarkin uh, event, I think for me, it's probably the same for everybody, I don't know. Um, every Sunday, I think Wednesday or whatever, you get 20 of them, give or take. So those, those are just handed out even though they are in insanely high demand. However, the shock prods on the left, the yellow kit, those are becoming far more in demand as each new character is introduced to the game. Those used to be reserved for like gear 11, 12. Now they've been pushed down into gear eight for some of them. Um, and and it's, just, it's just really maddening how much these are needed these days. And of course you need that for gear 12 moving into relics for a lot of characters. So the yellow kit is worth about 2,000 or exactly 2,001 hundred crystals while the red one is 2,000 crystals and the blue one is 1775 crystals now if you are extremely lucky and you drop that 4% chance to get the bottom one that one is worth 3,500 crystals okay it's 1400 for the battle 1400 for the cuffs and then 700 for the implants so the question is is it a good deal well at a minimum five dollars is getting you 1775 pieces or value of crystals at a maximum 3500 and when we compare that back to the five dollar bag of crystals i'll let you decide for yourself but for me unequivocally the answer is yes because it breaks down to a minimum of 355 crystals per dollar up to 700 and just for the fun and because i couldn't help myself i went ahead and bought four of these and here's what i pulled i'll share those results with you hey if you like this video hit the like and subscribe button down below let me know in the comments what else you'd like to see and i will do my best to try to break something down for you or share my thoughts all right thanks for watching